Oh, hi, hi. How you doing? How you doing? All right, so NFL, the year in your review, so to speak. I know it's not over. There's still the Super Bowl, but I'm sorry. I don't really have hope in one of the teams, so I, I think it's over. I, I really do. It's going to be the – oh, if you could have had I, – I guess it's not going to be too bad, but I hope the Giants – do better than what I think they're going to do. I, I really have, it, it probably is probably one one of the it probably actually could be actually one of the best endings to a Super Bowl because you're going to see Eli Manning in Indianapolis where his brother plays football. So actually, I guess it's not that bad. But you're going to see them versus the Patriots. I really do think the Patriots are just going to kick the living shit out of them and really just make it a miserable Super Bowl because. They have been on like running roughshod on the NFL this year, and they really have been. I mean, the last I think like seven, six, six or seven teams they beat by like twenty points. You know, they didn't do it to the Ravens because Ravens were you know they they gave them a run for their money. You know, they gave them a run for their money, but they just I, I think the Ravens like messed up a couple times, and which you know they could have made you know some plays, and you know they, I, I really would have loved to see the Ravens versus you know whoever, and I see the Ravens win the Super Bowl, but. I think it would have been more of a hard fought, you know, Super Bowl. But now it's going to be like, ah, the Giants have to play. It's like, you know, so if the Giants mess up at any point during the Super Bowl, they're going to be done because the Patriots are on a roll. They were going to win the Super Bowl, guaranteed. They're probably going to win the Super Bowl. That's my bet. If the Patriots are going to win, I hope the Giants can win, but I just don't see it happening. Patriots probably going to win by like, I think I think they'll win by probably two touchdowns because I just think Giants are gonna mess up somewhere down the road. It's like they're gonna miss by like I'm gonna say 17 points because they're gonna, you know, they're gonna like guarantee they're gonna get two, two touchdowns and they'll probably do, do a field goal as well. So they're probably gonna lose by like close to 20 points. So that's my prediction for that. Uh, but, I mean, throughout this year, you know, it, it's been kind of a weird football season because Colts weren't very good because they uh, my boys the Colts. I had to go root for the Bengals because the Colts were horrible this year. Um, I, I rooted for them at the beginning, but like they gave them pain almost all season. It's like uh, they tried carry Collins, it didn't work out. He got injured because he's old, broken down, it didn't work. And then he wasn't. I don't even think he was that great to begin with when he was with the Colts. I don't even think they even won when they had him. But, but you know, it was pointless to bring him in. So you know they got that done with, and um, you know, they put Painter in there. Then at the end of the season, they started winning. They, got the, they put a third stringer in there. But they found out it was pretty good. Right. Yeah, when you try that before, when you start losing with Painter, you dumbasses. But anyway, Painter played all season. They found this one guy who was like a third string quarterback on their team. And they started playing him toward the end just to give him time probably to play. And he ended up winning. And I'm like, no, don't win now. There's, you're going to ruin your chance to get the number one draft pick. So they, they, they cemented their spot. They got the number one draft pick, so I'm happy about that. So hopefully this year if they get Andrew Luck, which hopefully they will get Andrew Luck. Um, he will come and be a great person on the court, um, on the Colts. Pink Manning, oh, right, that's, that's cool. That's cool, but he better play. He'll play good. They better put Luck in, I'm telling you right now. Screw this bull crap. Injured, whatever. I'm not playing this Palmer bullshit. We're not doing this whole thing that the Bengals had to go through with uh, Palmer, you know. So Palmer, oh, I mean, t- talking about Palmer in the Bengals, Palmer sucking horribly on the Raiders. I don't think they won very much this year, but they made it farther than, you know, they made it farther than the Colts. So, uh, and the Bengals. But Bengals, Bengals had a really run. The AFC is really, really rough. I mean, they have a lot of great teams in the AFC. So, you know, coming from that, it really is like it, it's really rough to be in the AFC. So the Bengals had a tough, you know, a tough ride. So they, um, you know, they made it to they, they faced the Ravens, I believe. That's who they faced, and they got knocked out. So it was like, oh man, wow. I mean, they made it to the playoffs though, and you know, they just couldn't get past. Um, I don't remember who they faced. I think it was the Patriots, I think. Nah, no, I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, Bengals got made it to the playoffs. I mean, so that was a good, was a good thing. Andy Dalton is amazing, and I think every year we're going to see him grow and grow and grow. And hopefully next year, we'll see a playoff run again. Um, we're actually more more of a Bengals fan now, so uh, Colts better bring their A game, or I'm going to switch teams there and there. It's not not just a thing who wins and everything, but uh, 
it's not just about who wins and everything, but um, definitely, they would, yeah. So, but uh, then we get to the Steelers, who are actually a fan. We have a lot of fans in this area. They made it pretty deep, too. And it's surprising that they got knocked out. That they didn't even make it that far. It's like, really? It's like, was it the 49ers when they took them out? It's like, wow. It's like, whoever saw the 49ers come out of left field and the 49ers come out of left field and uh, destroy the uh, Steelers. I'm pretty sure it's the 49ers. I don't think it was the Giants. Somebody, somebody took out the Steelers. I don't know. But I mean, straight to the point is where I, I just don't think it's going to be a great Super Bowl. And Indianapolis finally gets a Super Bowl. You know, it's you know, I'm, I'm from Indiana, and in Indiana, I don't believe ever held a Super Bowl. If it had, they ended it for a while. So Indianapolis finally got a Super Bowl. You know, and it could be this. I guess Peyton will be happy because he'll get to see his brother for free because he has to come play a game. <laughs> it's about it, Peyton. And he's probably his ass hated to him. So, he better be ready. <clears throat> they say, you know, they always say, like, Eli's as good as Peyton, or you're almost at least. So, we'll find out because Brady's supposedly the best quarterback in the league right now, supposedly. So, um, we'll find out. Kind of weird, because I, I could have swore Brady was injured like a year or two ago, and basically it's the same thing. Patriots didn't do very good at all. Uh, and this year, you know, Peyton wasn't gone, so they weren't very good at all. Um, but you've seen some rookies actually, you know, start to show that they do have talent. So, hopefully Peyton getting back this year or getting Andrew Luck, whichever, whoever we're going to have as quarterback, you know, having them have a lot of practice this season to suck ass. Hopefully they got that out of their system and uh, actually bring the A game this year in uh, 2012, at the end of 2012, um, when the season starts again. Um, and all the flock out didn't help either, so there you go. Um, so, yeah, that's been my NFL prediction. So I, I really think the Patriots are going to win by like 17 points. Um, so basically it's going to be like a 20-point 20, 20 lead. Over the Giants, that's what I think. I, I just, I just don't, I just don't have any faith. After what I've seen the Patriots do, holy shit, yeah, they were tearing them up. They were tore the Ravens up. The Ravens were actually playing a good game. That's what impressed me. I was like, damn, you know. But I mean, I don't really like Tom. I don't know something about Tom Brady. I just don't like. So I don't know what it is. So it's just you know, not that they're winning, but it's just like he's, I don't know. I, I just don't know what it is. Something about. Him, I just don't like. It's probably just because of the rivalry between the Colts and the Patriots. It's the reason why I don't like them. I don't know. But it is cool that the Patriots, you know, made it this far. But the only thing I don't, don't like is Tom Brady getting another ring. You know, another, I didn't mean to flip you off. But <laughs> another ring to pull his finger. I, I don't want that to happen. So uh, let's Giants just whoop their ass just for that point. Tom Brady not to get another ring. So, um,. Yeah, but that's my prediction. The Patriots are probably going to win it by like 17 points. All right, thank you, and hope you watch it. And promise I won't do any more NFL videos again because I know I, I suck horribly at doing this, and I don't know much about football either. What's it, what's if they get a goal? What's that called? They call that a um, is it goaltending? No, I don't know. See, I don't know anything about football. Anyway. That's, I like to watch it. That's all I know. And I know the basic aspects of the sport, so <laughs> I'm just fucking with you. I know it's touchdown, all right? All right, so thank you. This has been Brad Tragic, and I'll stick to what I know. Music, movies, and pro wrestling, so thank you, BradTragic.Weebly.com. Check it out.